My second tip for finding shadowing opportunities if you don't personally know a doctor is to check your school's career or alumni office. Usually universities have some kind of career center or like alumni connections where they try to get undergrads to be able to talk to their alumni. So back when I was attending Cornell, we actually had kind of like an internal LinkedIn platform where alumni can put their contact information down, including their email, phone number, Alumni can even put if they're willing to let um, undergrads shadow them or like follow them at work for a day because this platform isn't just limited to healthcare professionals. I point this out because pre-med sometimes overlook this sort of resource because it's not pre-med specific, it's not even medicine specific, but for me, I was actually able to find physicians on there sharing their contact information, sharing their office phone number. You might be like, Cindy, that's just cold calling. And I, I agree, it kind of is like cold calling because I don't know these people. However, the difference between this and like straight up cold calling is that these physicians put their information in a readily accessible location and have indicated that they're willing to let you shadow them. And so knowing that fact ahead of time and knowing that they're willing to mentor students helped with my anxiety, I think. I know these sorts of career platforms are usually aimed at, you know, consulting or finance or, I don't know, people trying to get a Google referral. But in my case, at least, I was able to find some doctors. And so if your school happens to have something like this, definitely don't overlook it.